Players in the Nigerian maritime sector have strongly kicked against the proposed enforcement of the presentation of vehicle logbook by the management of the Nigerian Customs Service. An official of the Customs Licence Agency Association, Dr. Kayode Farito, said that the policy is a retrogression and could be seen as means of extortion for law enforcement officers. The agent, while reacting to the circular from the Office of the Ed, Trade and Tariffs Deputy Controller General of Customs, Talato Issa, said that the relevance of the logbook, which has its legal backing in the Customs and Air Science Management Act Notice No. 33 of 1971, has been outdated because the details of the vehicles, which were usually included in the logbook, have now been taken care of through the vehicle identification number. Farito warned that the new policy may encourage fake logbooks. On its part, the NCS spokesman of the Customs Headquarters Abuja, Deputy Controller Joseph Atta, said that the presentation of logbook will renote true information about imported used vehicles. I think for us to make the world know what is happening, we are not in Banana Republic for crying out loud. A Nigerian Customs Service is a member of WCO. If we write now to WCO that our customs is acting for logbook, it becomes a laughing, laughing uh, Nigeria becomes a laughing stock. So we want this circular withdrawn, and we are calling on the Senate Committee on Customs and Excise to look inwardly and look at the operation of customs and expedite the passage of the amendment on the Nigerian Customs and Excise Management Act, so that we be in tune with what is happening. Uh, to be in line with international best practice. 